In the public schools, we see um, just an overall cultural decline of spiritual suffocation, academic decline as well. And at Grove City Christian School, we are committed to training up the next generation of Christian leaders, preparing them for their next steps in life, in learning, and also in leadership, all through a foundation of faith in Jesus Christ. Oh, is it gonna be my biggest one today? You wind up, oh! Every day on my train. So my first year of teaching, I worked at a um, community school. And so I really got to see the difference. And what's great about this atmosphere is that we all are building on each other's beliefs and when they are finished with elementary school. I know that those same things are happening in the upper grades too. You know, I have my kids here for that reason. We have three teenagers and we know that as they get older, naturally, our influence is less and less. So it was really important that the kids would be surrounded by people that shared our values. And at Grove City Christian, the teachers and staff and even peers and other families share our values and that gives us immense peace. I'm also very thankful for all of the teachers that taught our kids all along the way. I truly did feel like they cared trying to do their very best to teach them not only just the academics, but about Christ and the Bible and just uh, living a godly life as they were growing up. And they weren't taught just knowledge. They were taught wisdom. What difference could I make? Have you ever had that thought? I know I have. But the truth is, there is always something that we can do to offer help and to show compassion. Academically, we want to teach curriculum that's rigorous. But what makes Grove City Christian School so unique is that it's taught through a biblical perspective. Kingdom education is more than just teaching. It's about shaping the hearts and the minds and the souls of our students, all in a way that glorifies and honors our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Being a Christian, that's how the world needs to see us. They need to see us as giving everything we have, knowing that people are watching us and they're trying to figure out who this Jesus person is. We want to be a witness in that, as well as outside of football, in the school, all those other things as well. They're not just concerned for their grades, academics, and the standardized scores that they get, but just of the whole individual. They know that's important, that leadership's important, that character's important, and that they're able to exercise their faith. I would attend the chapels and it was just such a blessing and my kids got to experience that and I would see them down in front worshiping and praising God. When you are telling your children at home, this is how we want you to live because it's what God has created you to be and you can find your identity in this. And so here, it's just such an honor to be able to do that. Christian education, is not a magic pill. You still have to go through life with your kids. They're still gonna make mistakes and they're still gonna learn things along the way just as we as parents learn things along the way. But you have that wisdom that's been imparted to them that you can rely on God and your kids are gonna be much stronger knowing they have that support system in their lives. You get to see them grow in Christ and all the people around them are pointing them to the same goal. This is our goal to grow and love others the way that Jesus loved them. We serve various churches throughout our community. It doesn't matter where you go, but the fact that there's a partnership between the school and the families and the churches is what we're founded upon. So we invite our families who are partnering with us to continue that partnership. And for new families, as they enter in, to expect that partnership. But we ask our families to come and to serve and to participate in the various activities that we have going on and to partner with us so that we can see our students flourish academically, spiritually, and overall in life.